Thomas and Friends Storytime. Sydney Sings. Starring Sydney the Forgetful Engine, Percy the Small Engine, and Sir Topham Hatt. Based on the railway series by the Reverend W. Audrey. Created by Britt Allcroft, read by Mark Marahan and Friends. This is a story about Thomas's friend Sydney, a dark blue diesel electric shunting engine. Sydney is a very kind, easy going engine, but he can be a bit forgetful. Sydney has a horn that sounds like this. So now you've met the hero of our story, let's begin our journey. All aboard for a big adventure. Sydney sings. It was a bright sunny day on the island of Sodor. Sydney was taking some cars to the Blue Mountain Quarry when he saw there had been an accident on the line. Percy had come off the rails at the bottom of Gordon's Hill. Rocky the crane was lifting Percy onto Thomas's flatbed. Sydney stopped beside them. Oh no! What's happened? Thomas and Percy began to explain. Percy's had a little accident. There was a loose rail and... I've damaged my wheels. A bit like when you damaged your wheels. Remember? But Sydney couldn't remember. Uh, not really. We need to get Percy to the steamworks, Sydney. Thomas explained. <gasps> I could take him. I'm not doing anything. <laughs> yes, you are, Sydney. You're taking those cars to the Blue Mountain Quarry. Am I? <gasps> yes, so I am. <laughs> oh, oh, bye now. Then Sydney hurried off, back in the same direction he had just come from. Thomas and Percy watched him go. Isn't he going the wrong way? <laughs> he must be the most forgetful engine ever. <laughs> A few days later, Sydney found himself at Knapford Station. Sir Topham Hatt was waiting for him. Ah, Sydney, are you busy at the moment? Busy? Uh, I don't think so. Well, in that case, I have a job for you. Percy's new wheels have arrived at Brendam Docks. Oh, um, why does Percy need new wheels? Because of his accident. But Sydney had forgotten all about Percy coming off the rails. <gasps> Percy's had an accident? Oh, no! This is a very special job, Sydney. I want you to collect the wheels and take them to the steamworks. <gasps> a special? Oh, how exciting! And I'll be helping my friend Percy. Oh, leave it to me, sir. Oh, dear. Thomas arrived. He could see that Sydney was looking troubled. What's the matter, Sydney? You know how forgetful I am, Thomas. I'm always setting off on a job and ending up in the wrong place. And now I have to collect Percy's wheels and I don't want to let my good friend down. But Thomas knew of a way he could help Sydney. Sometimes when I want to remember something important, I make up a little song to remind me. Annie and Clarabelle thought this was a great idea. We like songs, don't we, Clarabelle? We love songs! <laughs> Something to help you remember, Sydney. Like this. So Thomas, Annie and Clarabelle sang a song to help Sydney remember where he was going and what he was supposed to be doing. Ha, 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 he, 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 a very special job for me. On the way to Brendam Dogs to fetch a very special boss. <laughs> oh, that's great. Thank you, Thomas. As long as I keep singing my song, I can't go wrong. <laughs> Now that Sydney had his song to help him, he was sure he wouldn't forget his very special job. Ha, 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 he, 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 a very special job for me, all the way to Brendam Docks to fetch a very special box. Then Sydney met Gordon, who was waiting at Wellsworth Station. Gordon! Gordon! Sir Topham Hatt has asked me to do a special. But Gordon didn't seem impressed. Ha! 
I've had more specials than you've had hot boilers. Gordon wished as he puffed away. Silly old Gordon. I'm a diesel. I don't have a boiler. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. Hey, hey, hey. A very special job for me. Oh, the way to... Uh, something important. But I've forgotten what... Talking to Gordon had made Sydney forget his song. Was it something to do with boilers? Oh, maybe I was on my way to Whiff's Waste Dump to pick up an old boiler. Yes, that must be it. <laughs> the harder Sydney tried to remember his song, the more muddled he got. Then he began singing the wrong words. Ha, ha, ha. Hey, hey, hey. A very special job for me. All the way to Whiff's Waste Dump to fetch a... Uh, a boiler, or was it a pump? Sydney arrived at Whiff's waste dump. Whiff was surprised to see him. Hello, Sydney. What are you doing here? Uh, I'm not sure, but I think I might be collecting a boiler. A boiler? But we don't have any boilers here at the moment. Oh, no. I've forgotten what I'm supposed to be doing. It's a shame you're not an elephant, Sydney. Whiff chuckled. An elephant? Oh, why is that, Whiff? They say that elephants never forget. <laughs> now Sydney began thinking about elephants. Oh, perhaps my special job was something to do with elephants. <gasps> yes, that's it. I was supposed to pick up an elephant. And with that, Sydney went happily on his way. Ha, ha, ha. Hey, hey, hey. A very special job for me. I must get there before it's dark to collect an elephant from the animal park. But when Sydney arrived at the animal park, the platform was empty. Sydney couldn't see an elephant anywhere. There's no elephant here. I must have got it wrong again. So a very sad Sydney headed back to Knapford Station to tell Sir Topham Hatt that he'd forgotten what his special job was. But at Knapford Station, some of the passengers had a different problem. Oh dear, where has that train got to? Sydney wondered why the passengers looked so upset. What's the matter? Our train hasn't arrived to take us to Brendam Docks. We have to get there quickly to catch our cruise ship. Then Sydney had another idea. <gasps> Maybe this is my special job. So Sydney coupled up to some coaches and the passengers climbed aboard. Ha, ha, ha. Hey, hey, hey. A very special job for me. These people are going on a trip and I'm taking them to catch their ship. At the docks, Sir Topham Hatt was wondering why Percy's new wheels were still in their crate waiting to be collected. I don't believe it. I sent Sydney to pick up these wheels hours ago. Then Sydney arrived. His passengers began telling Sir Topham Hatt what a useful engine Sydney had been for bringing them to catch their ship on time. Wonderful little diesel you have here. A very useful engine indeed. Uh, 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 job done, sir. Smiled Sydney. Sir Topham Hatt looked very confused. But uh, uh, what about Percy's wheels? Huh? W what do you mean, sir? Oh. I wanted you to take Percy's new wheels to the steamworks. <gasps> oh, you mean you want me to do another special? Oh, I'd be delighted. When Sydney arrived at the steamworks, Percy was still waiting for his new wheels. Sydney, where have you been? Sydney tried hard to remember everything he'd been doing. But he began to get very mixed up. Oh, well, I've picked up an elephant from the waste dump. Uh, 
to bring Gordon the Earl's new boiler. Elephant? Boiler? But what about... Percy wasn't sure what Sydney was talking about. But he was happy when he saw the crate of wheels on Sydney's flatbed. <gasps> My wheels! Huh? Oh, yeah! I brought your new wheels! <laughs> you didn't think I'd forget, did you? <laughs> 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 what were you laughing about? The end.